Ladies and gentlemen, the next inductee into the JMU Archery Hall of Fame is so busy making an impact on our great sport on a daily basis, we were afraid he wouldn't be able to take enough time to come join us as we try to honor him. Those of you who know Rob Caulfield know that archery has always been a family affair, and we only wish we could share this celebration with his dad. However, we are thrilled that we're fortunate enough to be able to share it with his partner in crime, Carol Caulfield, and his daughter, Casey. When Rob was a young pup, he was a real hoot. You never wanted to see him get too much free time, because if he did, you knew there was going to be some trouble brewing. One year, Rob and his dad talked Bob into shooting the Easterns when it was held in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Bob lucked out and won the tournament, and about 30 seconds after it was over, Rob drove his truck out into the middle of the field, opened the doors, and started blasting a country tune that Bob had never heard with lyrics he'd never forget. Something along the lines of, you really tick me off. This is a mixed crowd, Rob. Everyone laughed and Rob had gotten his revenge. Seriously, Rob was fun 24 seven. And when he wasn't busy with getting into trouble or doing what needed to be done, his mind always came back to archery. Somehow, Rob focused on what was important enough to go to archery practice attend a few classes, and get all of his work done. He must have done ter pretty well at that, since he graduated from JMU with a business degree and earned All-American honors all four years, from 1980 to 1983, and even earned a bronze medal at the 1983 U.S. Intercollegiate Archery Championships in Arizona. Rob continued to compete after graduation and in 1984 was ranked fourth overall in USA Archery rankings. Rob had the honor of representing the U.S. in 1984 in Finland as a member of the World Field Championship team. He represented the USA once again in 1988 as a member of the World Field Championship team in Bolzano, Italy. Rob also shot in the Olympic Festival as an East, team, East Region team member. In 1983, Rob founded and continues to serve as president of the Lancaster Archery Supply. LAS is now the largest archery-only wholesale and retail distributor in the United States. Lancaster Archery employs 160 people, enabling them to make a living while supporting their habits. Through Lancaster Archery Supply, Rob has been able to provide support to World Archery, USA Archery, NFAA, ASA, IBO, ATA, S3DA, Pope & Young, NASP, and the Lancaster Archery Foundation. In 2004, Rob founded and continues to direct the Lancaster Archery Classic which is now the largest archery tournament in the East. Starting with just over 100 shooters, he's now drawing over 2,700 archers in 2024 from around the world. Many tournament archers, including top professionals, consider this to be the best tournament they shoot all year. In 2013, Rob founded and continues to serve as president of the Lancaster Archery Academy the best archery academy in the U.S. Through the Lancaster Archery Academy, Rob is able to reach thousands of new archers every year while offering classes, lessons, seminars, and special training programs to elite archers looking for an edge. In 2019, Rob founded the Lancaster Archery Foundation to give back to the sport that has given us all so much. Since 2019, the Lancaster Archery Foundation has awarded $119,000 equipment grants to help grow archery at the grassroots level. Two, partnered with Easton to provide 22 $5,000 grants to clubs to help them grow their youth archery programs. Three, awarded six grants to help archers cover travel expenses to self-funded international tournaments such as the World 3D Championships in 2022 and 2024, 
the World University Games in 2022, the World Youth Championships in 2021 and 2023, and the World Field Championships in 2024. And four, they've also funded scholarships for students participating in the sport of archery at JMU and Texas A&M. Somehow, along with all this, Rob found time to serve on the Board of Governors of USA Archery and the Board of Directors of the Archery Trade Association. Your dedication to the growth and development of our great sport has made USA Archery, James Madison University, and your dad very proud. Ladies and gentlemen, meet your newest member of the JMU Archery Hall of Fame, Rob Coffold.